Hello YouTube, we're back to Champion Stone. Let's hit fast forward on this. So, um, last game. Oh, we are not keeping this open. Um, last game, what we did was we got our fisherman going. We got him going. Level two. He's gonna make it. He's clumsy, that sucks. Um, but we got him going. So yay! We eventually get that done. Uh actually there's one thing I wanted to see, hand tools. How high level was the strong fish? Level 11. Okay. Level 11, which means actually she's level 7. She's actually not that far away from being able to make that. Once she is, we will and then make him a better fisherman. Um, we're bringing in flats. Mind you, not a high amount of it yet, but it's coming. To the hoeing the cotton. Oh yes, we got done with that layer. So I think we want to take this one more layer off. And we're not going to take all, we'll take this off. I basically don't want to waste my time mining just the dirt right here because I don't want to take this whole dirt hill out. So after this we'll start finding kind of the nest area that we think we should start uh, harvesting up. And take that, that. Now we do need dirt. You need dirt in this game to make bricks and stuff. So it's not like we're not going to take any dirt. Take those. Take those. That. Oh, we're fine with taking that. Alright, so we'll take that. Get some more stone in. Um, we also got some ores out here. How close is she to level 8? She's getting there to level 8. Once she's level 8, she can actually take this sucker out. Okay, we'll go ahead and dig that out too. Yeah. Go ahead and dig that out. Um, that's probably all of the mining we're going to do on that hill. Next, we'll probably run out here and just have her take some of that down. Um, and then we'll start looking at other places. We got this here. We may actually start making our mine going into this hill and have that hill as where our mine is going to be. We may. I don't know. We'll see. Alright, so I don't want you to craft a tree. Which tree are you trying? Oh, oh, because I put one too many. Let's go ahead and cancel this. Alright, so hopefully we get another migrant today, but I don't think we are. Our food stocks are dropping some because we took him off of foraging. So we knew that was going to happen until he got some levels. And he will get levels. He has 21 food on him right now. Now I'm wondering, because something I don't know is, you see? That's fine, that's great. Something I'm not sure of is, does he get experience as he's fishing? Or is it like every time he throws out the pole, he gets it? Every time he throws out and pulls in or whatever, he gets experience at it. That I don't know. Because you got the little progress bar there. And he pulls in the food every time. I'm assuming that as he gets a higher level, I think it's that uh, he gets faster and he's able to pull in more food at one time. Right now, I think he just pulls in one food. So he has one. Yeah. So he just pulls in one food. Alright, so. But he will get there. And we are at 9 migrants, so 10. So we need 300 food for the next migrant. Um... Right now, their food production really isn't there because they have not uh, got to a point where they can make all of that. We got flats coming in. How much flats fiber do we have coming in? Let's go. Or oh, that is our fiber. So I think Rosalind is our permanent miner. Nope. So we're gonna have her go back to tailoring for a little bit. So we'll make up that flats. Um, we got 277 stone. So she can go back to building. And, oh, oh, that was a glitch. Okay, I saw like a gr Okay, so. Whoa, 49. 
fine. We've got 31. Wow. Um, what does it take to make cloth? Cloth. Let's look at cloth. We got 52 flat fiber, 30, and it takes a loom. All right, so workshops. Uh, objects, workshops, loom. We are going to put in the loom, and we're going to put it in right here. Then we're going to put in the tanning rack. We're going to put that in right there as well. So what level does he have to be at to make cloth? Level 3 for that. Level 2. Level 3. Okay, so. I want her to try to keep 10 cloth out of flats. Then we're going to have her try to keep another 25. There we go. So, well, we had to have shears. That's right, we had to have shears. That's right, I forgot about that. So he has to have shears. Okay, well, I think... I want you so we're gonna target some of this iron Josie is level 9 see, has he already made all that process material I see yeah strong temper almost there so we're gonna up this a 500 well we do 400 again then we're also going to up this to a hundred. And see how close, okay. Alright, where is she at building? We need you blacksmithing. Level 3, so let's see what we can do with the level 3. Okay, so try to maintain 10 from these. And these, we're going to do another standing order for 100 so that whenever she has it in, she will hopefully create it. Alright, so let's look at how she does level wise with uh, so her levels. I mean, if she got that much off of one level, that's not bad. Not bad at all. Nope. So that was more than one level, but... Let's see, how much does she get off of this? Alright, now what can she create? Can she create anything to get low? And this is kind of what she had to do in the beginning to get levels up. Because I don't think she can create the shares yet. No, I want the hand tools. Can't see create shears. Level 4, no. But we are going to need knives. So, we'll go ahead and make two of those. Yeah. So, we'll go ahead and make two knives. Um, we're going to go ahead and have her be a stone mission right quick. And so go ahead and make some of those tools. Because you need to keep holding, buddy. There, you got your hoe. Alright, we're yellow for wood. That's fine. Now, to get the blacksmith up, I could take and make mining cards. A bunch of them to delete them and then do this over and over again. But I don't like to do that. And it's always seemed a really, uh, well, cheaty thing to me. All right, have we got any more iron up here revealed? No, but we got copper there. Oh, yeah, another piece of iron. So one piece isn't going to do us a whole lot, but we do get 10, 10. All right, where's she at? Level 8. Level 8. Okay, so... 
I'm going to go ahead and put that to get mined. And then after that, I'm going to want her to... Oh, yeah, we got a bunch of iron down here. What I'm going to do is I'm basically going to look around at these things. I'm just going to go ahead and have her mine out the metals and such. So I think that's all the metals in that one. Uh, we got some over here. What I really want is the copper. More so than the iron right now. We don't have any lying around any stacks of stone in our little humble abode here, do we? No. Uh, now this is one, one good thing about creating a mountain kingdom especially is you would generally have a shit ton of surface ores. Okay. So let's see what her level's looking like. Okay, she's getting there. So we're gonna do her as a stonemason. Actually, we can do both of them as a builder. So builder, builder. And we'll have both of them trying to, I mean, the wall's almost there, guys. It's not that far away. All right. Are they planting some more seeds? They just hoeing. Oh, they're harvesting. Good, good, good. More food in. How's this guy out here doing? He's way over here. We're going to deconstruct that. I don't want that out here. How's his level? Okay, so he's level three. He's getting some levels. How's our crofter level looking? Level 10, so she'll start making some strong timber. And we will actually start putting that to sell as well. So we're gonna put her down here. Well, first we'll have her drop her stuff off. And we'll have her go ahead and grab the more because I want to go ahead and start doing some blacksmithing. Try to get her up. Well, you know what? We'll just wait till she naturally puts the stuff up. Can't have her get like this. Alright, so. That's one iron ore on her already. There's two there. There's three there, so that'll be two more. We got one here. How much are these weighing her down? A lot. So we let her put them up and then we'll run her back out here. Uh, we got them bringing in food. So we're supposed to see like an explosion of food. Nope, nope, come back out here. Once you get those, and then we're not gonna worry about having her hit those afterwards. Oh, her tool park. Okay. A merchant. All right. We'll check on him in a second. We'll check on him in just a second. All right. So I don't care what you do after that. All right. Where's he at? He's still a ways out there. Okay. He's still a ways out there, guys. But... You want to check processed material, not processed, raw. We want to make sure we get copper, buy, uh, scrap metal, buy. And then we're doing two ores we want to buy. Um, I don't think we really need to buy anything else. No. I don't even know what you can do with bones. Oh. 
What, see, he's supposed to be a builder? Oh. Stone Mason. So is our blacksmith, let's see. So where did our... Go back to blacksmithing. Alright, so who, I think it was our miner. Yep. Go to being a trader. Alright, let's see how close she gets. Now, if I'm to a point where I barely don't have a level, then I might actually consider doing a minecart. If it's like I can build two minecarts, then I'll build them for storage. But I won't delete them. So she pretty much has to make it off of this one. Uh, oh, yeah. Turn up. Yep. So we got our turn ups, which means. We've got all of our seeds. Let's make sure they're all set to sell right quick. Yep. So we got all the seeds in the game. Alrighty, so. So you may actually be able to get there. Yeah, she's going to get there. Thank God. Because once we start making a cloth, that's going to lead us in making patterns, which we can not only equip to our people to make them faster, we can also sell them to make money. So shears are what we want to quarry up. Uh, hand tools. We got five ingots. Um, going to have six, so we're going to put two in the quarry. Right, level four. There we go. All right, so should be able to start working that loom because it takes shears to work the loom and a knife to work the uh, to work the tanning rack. So you can go back to being a miner. Uh, where is she? Okay, she's gonna go make that other pick, and after that, she's gonna go back to her tailoring profession. Actually, go back to stone mason now, right quick. We're going to let her fill in the gaps while she's doing her thing. Alright, she should be good. Now she can go back. Now I really didn't necessarily have to make shears right now, but it's a good idea to have them. I like having them. Bam. So. Excuse me. Alright, I'm going to have her back to being a stonemason. Anything to do? Nope. Go, go to being a builder then. See, we'll make the cloth level five. So I want to look at armor. So the garbage stone we're gonna to want to make. I never make this tonic. I just skip it. But the garbage stone we're all gonna make. But we need to be level nine. However, we only have to be level four to make this. And we are gonna sell it. So we're gonna tell her to maintain. Actually, I ain't gonna maintain. We're gonna have her make nine of them right now. Get a wolf spotted. So, oh, where's that? And we're gonna go ahead right now, since we know we're gonna have them and maintain an inventory. As fast as he's making them, people will pick them up. All right, now let's check out this wolf, guys. Check out this wolf. Um. I'll wait, hopefully it's just one. Is it just one wolf? It actually is. So we are going to have him be infantry. He should be able to take on one wolf. I'm going to charge this guy. Oh no, two wolves. Three wolves. Okay. So.
So we know the deal. Infantry. Everybody but our farmer and our fisherman is going to be infantry. Alright, that should be enough people. And he should start going back. Three wolves. Not that many. We'll stop him there. He's fine. Then here, start going back. And you can just do kind of stop method too. Oh, miscellaneous. Alright, so we got everybody up here? Good. Let's charge these suckers. And watch them run. They're all going after him. And we'll gather their corpses. There we go. We can fast forward this. We don't have to worry about them dying to one stinking wolf and there's that many. Booyah! And that is how you deal with wolf attacks. I am a professional wolf killer at this point. Now with that being said, the game has a way when you think you've got something down pat of just flipping it on you. Alright, forger, miner, woodchopper. Uh, I want to go stone mason for right now. Go back to your carpeting job. You're going to stay fishing. Back to being a tailor. Alrighty, so the other thing we can start creating. Uh, let's go to armor. Now that we're actually getting some dependable cloth in, it's patones. Alright, so we're going to try to maintain 10 of those. Actually, no. We're going to do like we did with her and just make 8. 9. Because I believe that's what we did with the arming caps. Let me make sure. And the reason I'm doing that right now is because I want them to be able to make both of them. So I want them to be able to sort of make both the arming caps and the light boots. And then after we get everybody equipped out, that's where we can take our SS resources. Turn them into that and make some mola. With that being said, we also want to see what do we have for leather boots. No leather, it takes a level 7. Alright, can we make level yet? L uh, level. Can we make leather le leather yet? We only got two animal hide. We're going to try to maintain 10 of those. Alright, so, and he's collecting some more. Oh, and more fur. Hmm. Alright, so. See, so they need to make some more picks. So he's going to be over here looming away. Are we tracking cloth, guys? Yeah, we are. Now, he's going to be taking a cloth as soon as he can make it. So we're not going to get army caps right at first. Not right at first, but... It'll be good. Um, those increase the speed, so that's always good. That's what we want. Oh, wait, 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 wait. A level 11. Bam! Make that. That was actually, I want to make two. We want to make four of them. 
yeah we're gonna do four and that will increase resources by six percent he's gonna create four of them so that we'll always have some in stock are you using a strong fishing pole yep so you're using a strong fishing rod so he is gonna get more food that's what I'm talking about um, so we're gonna sell this we're not gonna track those we don't need to track those we actually we're gonna maintain five in stores, sell them and see how they do selling wise all right so why isn't C making any more cloth Why not? Um, hmm. Oh, that's fine. We need to put down another miscellaneous crate. Objects, storage. Uh, I just always forget that. Like, if you find that stuff isn't like storing or such, then the first thing you should do is check your miscellaneous storage uh, I'm gonna put one over there we we'll stick them one up here too because or check your storage most time the reason you're not creating anything is because your storage is low <laughs> alright so so sure go back to oh it's gonna make some leather now So leather boots, mm, um, armor, which boots, leather, takes four pieces, level seven. So we're, wait, we don't have anywhere near dependability. Yay, we got all the pumpkins planted, all the potatoes, we still haven't got all the corn all the carrot or all of the turn up okay guys so we are at that point again we want to take stock of what we did this wall is coming along it's close to being finished he's getting close to finish off this layer wow you see that it looks really different um he's getting close to finishing off that layer we had to start looking at where he's on the mine nets um we are getting some basic armor and such coming up like patterns so he's making some of that uh, we got two of the arming caps made so we are getting some basic stuff made here guys we're gonna go ahead and set them to sell so we don't have to do it later so thank you for watching uh, leave a like subscribe if you uh, like what we're doing it really helps to encourage us uh, leave some comments if you have any questions if you want to be part of the settlement what have you and I will see you next episode guys deuces